All right, welcome to the Ravid Show. We are here at the .com 2025. Look who are with me. Lizzie is here. Lizzie, welcome to the Ravid Show. Thank Super you. excited to meet you and chat with you. I saw your keynote today and great announcements that were made at the product launch. Um, I'm kind of excited to you know chat yeah. with you today more about data visualization. Yes. And since we're here at this area, and I know your team works a lot around data waste, can you tell us more about what your team is working on? Yeah, absolutely. So I'm Lizzie. I'm the product manager for dashboards at Splunk. Yep. So my team covers everything related to how customers visualize their data in Splunk. So here at the booth, we show everything from our general purpose dashboarding mm -hmm. tools to what we call the Splunk UI Toolkit, which is a collection of React packages where people can do custom development and build really any kind of data visualization that they want in Splunk. That's fantastic and uh, great insights. I've been you know, also meeting a lot of enterprise leaders here who've sure. been using the product and they have great things to say about you know, data ways in the product that you all have been putting together and uh, also shipping non-stop uh, features. Um, right. Talking about that, uh, I'm kind of also curious to know what makes dashboards at, at Splunk special? Yeah, well, I think it really starts with our customers. They have such unique use cases where they need to ingest tons of data and they need to visualize really complex things like um, network diagrams, mm -hmm. floor plans. They want to co connect like operational data with IT data. And so yep. dashboards allows you to put together really complex views with high data density, so you can really visualize anything you want. So we give a lot of flexibility to our customers to be able to do exactly that. Fantastic. Talking about customers, I know uh, you'll have a lot of customers here. What are they most excited about? Uh, can you share a little bit about that and uh, how are they getting the in-depth view of the dashboards? Yeah, that's a really great question. So I think there are two things that really stand out. The first thing is that Customers want to pack more data than ever before into their dashboards. Right. So we recently released something called tabs in dashboards. Mm -hmm. Basically allows you to have multiple dashboards in one. So you can get all the visibility that you need, start at a high level overview, drill down into technical details. So nice. it can support everything from an executive looking at a dashboard to an analyst who needs to drill in. The second thing I think is really cool is customers want different ways to explore their data. So we've added a lot of features to help make more dynamic um, dashboards where you can embed lots of complex logic that makes mm -hmm. it really intuitive for an end user to navigate through all that data. I think definitely that is something what a lot of data leaders that I talk to also Absolutely. face issues with. But if you're kind of solving that problem, that makes it super easy. Talking about a little bit more about the features as well, what are you most excited about when yeah. it comes to you know the data ways in the dashboards that you all create? Yeah, well, I think really doubling down on having those complex, dynamic dashboards, mm -hmm. we introduced the ability to conditionally show or hide panels, to be able to add lots of advanced logic in the background so that you can create dashboards that honestly are almost like web applications. That's how in, uh, dynamic that they, they are. So when users are interacting with them, they can navigate all different kinds of ways through their investigations, through their data to find you know whatever issue or root cause they're trying to get to. Love it. Uh, one last question for you is around if folks want to reach out, learn more about the different features that you all keep pushing together, but also if they want to try the product, where can they do that? Yeah, absolutely. Well, any Splunk customer has access to Dashboard Studio in their own environment, so they can nice. just get started there. But we have a really great community in our Dashboard Studio Slack channel. So that's the Splunk user group Slack channel. Any customer can join. They can reach out there with feedback, questions, and our product team is there to answer. Amazing. Uh, Lizzie, I promise this is the last one. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> if folks want to reach out to you, follow you, which is the best channel? Uh, LinkedIn or honestly Slack. Uh, okay. So in our Spl Splunk community, that's the best place. Awesome. This yeah. is great. Uh, thanks for sharing all the great insights, yeah. Lizzie. All the best to you and your team. Thank you. You too. Thank you. Thank you everyone for joining us.